everyone welcome to vlogmas day four so today we're going to be doing a winter themed nail set of course as usual we're using all of your products when i tell you this nail set was truly a trust the process nail set i actually took the time to do a little bit of work beforehand and figure out the design that i was going to do but you'll see later on i ended up switching the design a little later on in the video and even adding a color that i initially wasn't planning on adding but in the end i was really really happy with it um so as a lot of you may or may not know i have an extreme allergy to gel products as well as um acrylic something that developed over time and it just really has been a burden burden on me but i really really love um nails so i didn't want to let that deter me so i found another way and the way that i found was just doing um press on nails on myself and just using regular nail polish um even with a lot of the regular like beauty supply nail polishes they would give me a little bit of irritation so that's why i turned to the zoya nail polish because i know zoya um they don't have a lot of those um additives that a lot of nail polishes have that cause me personally um allergies so when I tell you guys, I haven't been doing nails for a very long time. I only do my own nails. So I really enjoy doing my press-ons. I know it's a lot of people out here who are probably thinking about doing their own press-ons and wanting to start. And I definitely do recommend it. I am not a um, professional by any stretch of the imagination. But I definitely try my best. I see the advancements and the progress that I have made. I'm going to try a lot of different techniques um, to try to master or just to learn a lot of different techniques that I see a lot of other nail artists using so like for instance on this nail set this is my very first time ever trying like the candy stripe um look and I did try to do something a little different so that it wasn't kind of like everybody else's candy nail stripe as far as like the color and then I've also never tried um snowflakes so I actually had to watch videos and try to figure out how to do it I did a lot of trial and error before I even cut the camera on I definitely feel like when you're starting out, you don't need to have a bunch of experience. You just have to have the ambition and the will to want to do your own nails. Um, press on nails are not um, the most difficult, but they're also not the easiest. It does take technique, and that is the reason why the people who sell um, press on nails, their nails are so good. It's not because they woke up like that. You know, I'm sure everybody has that ability to be great at a lot of different things, but they practice just like I'm practicing. Just like if you decide to, you're going to practice as well. So I just wanted to give a little bit of motivation for anybody that was thinking about doing press on nails. Um, I never planned on doing my own press on nails. I enjoy going to the shop, getting my nails done and things like that. But my allergies just, it wasn't worth it. It wasn't worth the hassle. It wasn't worth the pain and, uh, and the suffering. So I do enjoy doing my own press on nails. Um, but I also, I do miss going to the nail shop and getting my nails done. But you know, pedicures are still a thing so i still get to enjoy a little bit of that um self pampering with um pedicures but i also do do my own pedicures as well but if i ever decided to go back to the nail shop to get pedicures then that's something that i could do as well um i don't mind doing my own press on nails but i do see the difference between when i went to the nail shop and when i do my own press on nails simply because when i do my own press on nails i actually get the nails that i want when i would go to the nail shop it was very rare that um, my nails would be the way that i actually wanted them to be in my mind because the way that I would want them to be in my mind would cost about $200 but now that I do my own press on nails I could do as much bling as I like I could do as much color as I like I could do whatever length I like and I don't have to worry about um that cost every single time that I uh, get my nails done because I did spend you know a, a nice little pretty penny on products ahead of time so um with these nails they um really when i tell you guys i really did not expect them to turn out as nice as they actually did but i'm super duper glad that they did turn out as nice as they did so um yeah i'll just let the music play now i just wanted to say that and just try to give somebody motivation who might want to think about um doing their nails um in the future i say definitely go for it try it out even if you want to start a business um try it out practice is always going to make perfect so i'll see you guys on vlogmas day five